Mum. Mum. I tried talking to Graham. He's Hang not... on one sec. Inset day, so school closed. Sorry for short notice and any inconvenience caused. Are they actually being serious? Again, weren't they off at the start of the week? Do you know, no wonder kids are not as bright as what they used to be. Not you, obviously. But... So you may as well take your uniform off and don't just throw it on the floor like you normally do. Oh, I was running around like an idiot this morning. Dad's things are now everywhere. Here, do you want to Oh, the parents moving back in. I mean, that's got to be the dream. Well, I know he's not telling me everything, mainly because he's my dad and he never tells me everything. Uh, anyway, that's it. They're uh, toy cars, playmat books and <gasps> Barry the Bear. But to be honest, just plant him in front of a screen and he'll be happy. Oh, no, babe. Today is Charity, Moses and Johnny Day of Fun. I happen to have found this brilliant website called Mumsnet. You've, um, <clears throat> you've been on Mumsnet? It's amazing. It's these mums, right, and they give advice on how to be a better parent. And they're not normal mums, they're experts. Right, if this is about yesterday... They're giving me advice on play dates, on lunchbox generators. I'm even thinking of making these guys a star chart. Charity, if you're trying to prove something, you don't need to. You've had the kids plenty of times and no disasters. Well, no disasters like this. Listen to this. Most embarrassing place you've ever soiled yourself. Ooh. Anyway, uh, I will see you later. Computer course, here I come. Mwah. Good luck, all of you. Bye-bye. Right, guys, listen to me. You two are now going to help me make a certain person see what a brilliant mum I really am. Are you ready for it? If Graham's not answering his phone... Hey, I'm just a little bit busy. Do you mind talking to me about this in a bit? Thank you. Graham, are you okay? Not now. I was just asking. I said not now. Tried calling Joe again. You told me yesterday. No, today too. I left messages. You should stop. They won't be returned. I need to know what happened. I don't understand. You want answers? Yes. You won't just leave. Get in the car. What? You can't drive, not in that state. Fine. You want to know what happened? Then start walking. I don't understand. Why are we at Cain and Moira's? Because you wanted answers and this is where you're going to find them. I just want to talk to my brother. You're going to find out why you're never going to talk to him ever again and you're going to hear it from the horse's mouth. Where is he? Please, Debbie, just tell him. No, I won't until he tells you why he's here. Noah wants to know all about Joe, and I think your father could help with that. What? Why? Is he here or not? No. Where is he? I don't know, and I've just asked you why you think he could help. Because often the answers we seek are closer to home than we think. And what does that mean? It means it's time you heard the truth about the day Joe disappeared. I'm not going to try and point the finger at my dad pointing it somewhere else. Because he was with me that day, at the wedding that never happened. Trust me, I should know. By your side. In the hospital chapel the whole day. And at home, supporting me and Sarah, yeah. Are you really as stupid as you are? And are you really just a drunk butler? Making a kid get in the car with you? It didn't drive. You are drinking yourself to death. And you know what? Nobody actually cares. Truth really does hurt, doesn't it? You're about to find out. So what? What are you saying? My dad's an easy target. And that Joe could never come back because he'll kill him? He's never could come back. Shut up! Just shut up! Joe would hate this, everything you're saying! You're right. You're right, Noah. You don't need to hear any of this. I think you should go home. No, I'm not getting pushed around anymore. By anyone! I have to help him, even if you don't want me to. Maybe we should do this. No, no, maybe we should do this now. 
after you've told me what you think it is my dad's done? He, um... He just loves you too much. What does that even mean? It means what I said. He just loved you too much. Graham, I miss him, and I know you do too. Don't patronise me. I don't need your sympathy. I wasn't. I detest your family, every single last one of them. Your gang of inbreds are the reason I'll never see Joe again. Don't! You think that he's worth that? He is worth nothing. If you're expecting me to No, I expect nothing from you. From the man that took Joe's phone and sent a text pretending to be him. But I tried calling him. I left messages. No, this just gets better and better, doesn't it? So you know the man that you want to help, your friend, that is what he's capable of. No, um... You heard them, the messages. No. no I'm I never going to speak to him again, am I? How could you do that to me? All I ever did was try and help you. Maybe I'm beyond help. And you know what, Graham? My family might be a lot of things, but we still got each other. And you have got nothing and nobody. So I don't detest you. I pity you. Now go. I shouldn't have even been with him. I just thought that he yeah, might... Well, just stay away from him from now on, please. Anyway, shouldn't you be going home? And you won't tell my mum? Well, I've been hiding stuff from that woman for years, so why change now? Hi. Hello, huh? You OK, love? Yeah. Apart from Graham dragging him up here, smashed. What? Are you kidding me? Desperate to see my dad. Because? Because apparently he knows more about Joe than what he's letting on. Well, what exactly did he say? He said loads of things that we were pathetic, that he hated us. But why would he say that about Dad? <sighs> but he's a drunk with nothing left, and he's looking for anyone to blame. I mean, him and Joe have been lying from the start, and now it's all caught up with him, he can't handle it. I mean, look what he did with Joe's phone. I mean, he can spin it any way he wants, but I just don't believe a word that comes out of that man's mouth. I'll see you in a bit. See you. Bye. And do you know what? Graham will probably forget he was even here by tomorrow. What are you looking at? Kids playing on a kids' pirate ship in someone else's back garden. Oh, why the face? You get killed on Fortnite or something? No. It's just a bit sad, isn't it? You are playing on a big shed. Well, if you must know, we got into a thing with another school crew. Kelthwaite. You're going to make them walk the plank? Ah, uh, ha, ha. We hacked the school computer, got everyone a day off. Think they can top that? That was you? No way. Right, well, believe what you want. I don't care. Fine. I'm in. Tell me what I have to do. What? Like, it's that easy? 